Uh, first, I'd like to uh, thank the quarterback club and, and Mr. Trey Hand for inviting me. Um, what I'm going to do, I'm just going to talk about our team, our team for this year. Uh, we, we, right now, we're having a good year. We're eight and two, and it's actually one of the better years uh, in the past ten for, for sports records goes Bell Chase. Uh, ten years ago, this past year, this year they won state. Bell Chase won state, so uh, so we're having a good year, you know compared to, to, to in the past 10 years. But um, the main reason I think we're having such a good year is senior leadership. I mean, we've got a real good group of seniors. Uh, we have 16 seniors on the team, and actually about 11 of them start for us. Um, and it goes back to last year. Last year we finished seven and five. We were six and four in the season. And we went up, we were 20, 28 seed, and we went to Plaquemine and then we upset them in the first round. And then we were, came back to Bell Chase and we played Woodlawn and Streetport. We were, and we were two yards from advancing to the third to the third round. We were at the two yard line and we ended the game and we just fumbled the ball. But, um, but it goes back to last year. And, and you know, after that loss, you know, they came back in the spring, uh, hit the weights really hard. We had a really good spring, a real good spring practice. Uh, good summer, and it's translated into uh, this, you know, to, to where, where, we are, where we are right now. Um, so, uh, you know, and then we, we're 8-2, and, and the two teams we've lost to is uh, Edna Carr and Warren Eastern. And uh, for you who know, keep up with high school football, those are two really good teams. Um, our district is Carr, Warren Eastern, Helen Cox, and Big Main. Um, so we, we beat the teams. Um, you know that we were as good as, or a little bit better, and we and we played we played call a good game, um, but but those are two really good teams, and and they actually in four A they're on the opposite side of the bracket, so you know unless somebody can knock them off, they're going to be in the dome. Uh, I, I you know unless like I said unless something happens, um, but uh, but this year this coming Friday we play uh, Carver High School. And the one thing about Culver High School, they're a, uh, what are they, we have 14, they're, they're 19 seed. And their record, they, 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 this is the first year they've won district in, I think, 14 years, I believe. And the one thing about Culver is they are very athletic and very fast. So as a, you know, we have a few, few we have a few kids that can run, um, Ralph Jones, we have a few guys that can run, but we are more, but we're not as a, a team speed as they are. So the thing we got to do this Friday, we play on Friday night, is of course the team that's a little slower, is we have to run the ball, and we have to make sure that we keep them, their offense on the sideline as much as possible. Um, so that's gonna be a big goal for us, um, because like I said, they, they're very fast, very athletic. Um, and just to mention a few of our players we have, we have um, you know a few of my seniors, like I said, we have a few guys that can run. We have Ralph Jones, who's a quarterback, running back, receiver, athlete for us. He has over 1,300 yards rushing this year. Um, our fullback is Sean Thompson. He's, and we run more option. We're a power team. Um, so he's our, full, our fullback, Sean Thompson. He's about 5'7", about 225. He's a three-year starter. And our quarterback's Jordan Mariana. Uh, he's a junior. Uh, about 5'7", about 175, but, but, but he is a kid, a player that could, he could have played in the 1960s. He's a throwback, just a hard, tough, just a, he's just a football player. And what we do, we run option and all, so he's getting hit a good bit, but, but he's, he's, a, he's, a, he's a heck of a player. Um, and our offensive line, we have four seniors, uh, as soon as uh, Cody Taylor, uh, Davion Turner, Two guards is Davion and uh, 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 Sherrod Manuel, and our tackle is Bryce Manis, and we have a, a sophomore, uh, Severo Relly, who's, uh, who's one of the starters. So those guys there are going to be a key for us this week. Like I said, we got to keep the ball. Um, and on defense, you know, we got an all-district linebacker, uh, Aaron Raggis, who's a good player for us. He was all-district last year. And um, you know, and as far as defense goes, we're going to have to just try to slow him down and. Um, don't give up the big play, you know. So, um, but that's that's about that's about you know all I have to say. Um, any questions? Anything about this week or, or whatever? Hey, coach, that was an exciting win for you uh, this past Friday night—the overtime win against Helen Cox. 
So well, my question is, is this game with Carver at Bell Chase or? It's at Bell Chase. Okay. So how's the field holding up? Uh, the field? Yeah. The field's in good shape. I, if I, you know, up, maybe now let me say, Carver down a little bit. Now let me say this. It's <laughs> going to rain a lot this week. So uh, we went to a field, a few, few high school, public high schools with, with, uh, with a grass field. So um, so if it's real wet, you know, it may, may help us out. But, 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 you know, but let me say this. We got to guard them. So as an offensive team, they know where they're where they're cutting at. They so you know it just depends now. If it was real muddy, maybe so. But the field's holding up. Yeah, the field's holding up. So, and I know y'all know the referees. Y'all y'all been there a few times where it's been uh it's kind of slippery. So uh, but it's it's, it's it's good as of now. Yeah. I appreciate it. Any other? All right. Thank y'all.